Good morning, babies. Welcome to Simply Stacy again. Today, our topic will be on Leah and Rachel. They both was wives of Jacob, and also they were sisters. And we'll be coming from Genesis 29 and 17. Now, this story, I want to talk to you ladies, because I want to ask you a question. Are you Leah or are you Rachel? Because so many women today, and even in past times, have had men that really don't love them. They love another woman. And you put so much time into them. You want to have babies by them. Thinking that they're going to love you. Want you. Stay with you. And I know in today's society. I know there's still some women that think like that. I don't know why. Because if that was a fact. All of us women would have our men. But uh, Rachel. Was Jacob's love that he really loved. Jacob was in this uh, country. And. He went to the father and he worked many years. He, he made a deal to work seven years to be able to marry Rachel. But when he went to go marry her after his seven years, he was tricked by the father. And uh, when he wound up going in there getting ready to have his honeymoon, his wife was the other sister, which was Leah. And I don't want to say ugly, but they consider her not the most beautiful as a woman. And then he tricked him. So then Jacob wound up working another seven years just to get the woman that he wanted. And ladies, I can't emphasize that no more. When a man wants you, he'll do whatever he got to do to get you. You don't have to beg, crawl, plead, try to make him want you. Women do all kinds of things to get men to want them and love them. And at the end of the day, all you do is wind up hurting yourself. Because if they don't want you, you can't make nobody want you. Even if you got the flesh in your house, that's all you got is a body. But you don't have his heart. And you see it every day. They're nasty. They're bitter. They're angry. Oh, they'll have sex with you. Just like Jacob did with Leah. Had all kinds of kids. And she kept hoping, kept hoping that, oh, he would love her. She was so sad and miserable. Because that man didn't love her. She wanted love. And that's how so many women are today. Wanting love and staying with men that don't really love them. And I see it more and more today that how men, they they got women in their lives. But there's other women that's really in their heart. And they live in lies. And women do the same thing too. Some of them got somebody out there that they really care about. And they're treating you all kinds of ways. Because you really ain't the one. You're not the one that's in the heart. So they treat you bad. They treat you really, really bad. But as I said before, Rachel was his heart. Rachel was the one that he loved. He's the one that he put the she was the one that he put the work in for. He loved her. He went back and wound up working another seven years just to get her. And work, that's a key word today. A lot of these babies don't want to work. These men don't want to work. Anything that you're going to love, you're going to make sure it's taken care of. You don't care what you got to do. Ladies, and you see this with yourself. You go work, you're going to take care of your babies. You're going to take care of them. Even the man, you take care of him because you love them. They should be doing the same thing for you. You the female. The man is ahead. Why we got to lead the path. They should be leading the path. Not just us. But we make all kinds of excuses for them. We don't make excuses for ourselves. We get on out there and do what we got to do. So they should be doing the same thing. They can preach that they the head, but can they be the head? It's one thing to talk something, but it's another thing to do it. I can talk all day long that I'm going to lose weight. That don't mean nothing until I get out there and I do it. And that's how it is with these men. They can talk that the head and all that, but until they get out there and do it and manifest that thing, it don't make no difference. They got to do it. Action. But I want you ladies to learn today. Are you Leah or are you Rachel? Are you contending for his love or do you have his love like Rachel? Because Leah just kept wanting to get his love, contending for his love, thinking that these babies that she was having was going to make him love her and get closer to her. But it never did because his heart went with her. She had the physical body. She was having his kids and she was faithful to him. But Jacob didn't love her. He never loved her like he loved Rachel. And I want to tell you that you want a man's heart. There's nothing more precious than getting a man's heart. That's what God wants from us. He wants our heart. He wants us to love him. 
That's the same thing with the devil and with God. A lot of people, the devil got their heart. They like the world. They like sin. They, they got their heart with the devil. And their heart's not with God. They only want God for what he can give them. But God wants our heart. That's why he says he weighs a man's heart. Well, babies, it was short but sweet, I hope, today. Love you. God loves you. And may the best be unto you today. Full of joy, happiness, and peace today. Smooches.